What is going on people? I am finally back. I went on this uh, vacation with some family over to Texas and I was gone for I want to say a little over a week but I am back. Hopefully I didn't really miss too much and um, I have a couple of things that I want to go over and uh, let you guys know what's going to be on the schedule. First things first, uh, you guys are probably well aware of uh, Huawei, but if you're not, if you don't know exactly how to go about uh, installing App Gallery and, and things like that, make sure that you follow the link in the description because it's going to have uh, uh, information about how to get App Gallery uh, installed and make sure that you take advantage of these discounts. But there is a campaign uh, for Lords Mobile going on right now which you can get even more discounts. So, you would usually get 20% off out of all of your purchases. Now, there is a Lords Mobile exclusive campaign going on right now that ends on the 2nd of April. So, you got to make sure that you do it beforehand. Now, here's how it's all going to go down. First of all, you're going to keep the 20% off that you already have. The 20% cash back. Now, with this, you have a chance to get up to 50% off with the App Gallery exclusive offer. Now, this started on the 20th of March and it's going to go all the way until the end of the 1st. So like I said, you'll have pretty much until the 2nd to get this done. And uh, it is for the UK, Ireland and New Zealand. Now, here's how it's going to go. If you don't have the uh, Lord's Mobile app installed directly from App Gallery, like I mentioned before, the information on how to get everything set up is going to be down in the description. I did a video on it, starting you from scratch all the way to getting it all set up. Uh, so if you're confused about that, make sure that you check that video out. But uh, here's the first offer. Offer one, you get free coupons of up to 27 and a half. And this will go depending on your currency, whether it's dollars, pounds, etc. I'll just say dollars because that's the currency I would use. But it would just be the currency that you would uh, you would be using. So in this case, you can get up to 27, uh, 27 and a half uh, dollars for me. Now, it says here that the way that this would work is that you'd have to spend this amount to get these coupons. So if you spend 15 plus dollars, you get these coupons. Once you spend 25 plus, you'll get this coupon, etc, etc. So once you spend over 75, um, right here, once you spend over 75, you'll be able to claim all four coupons, which will equal to the 27 and a half. Now, and I don't know why this keeps popping back up. Um, anyway. Uh, and then, of course, on top of all of that, you get the 20% cash back on all of those purchases that you make. So if you want to be able to make some of that money back, get the cash back plus these coupons that you can use on extra packs later on down the road, especially with some, so many of the $5 and $20 packs that are coming out right now that are super, super good value, I would suggest definitely going this route, getting these coupons and getting these discounts. Now, on the Lord's Mobile side, uh, I don't know if you guys have heard, but there is going to be a new hero coming out. Now, it has not been announced exactly what hero is going to be. Essentially, it is going to be a collaboration, Lord's, Mo Lord's Mobile with uh, Knights of the Zodiac or Saint Seiya, whatever you want to call it. I know them as, as uh, Knights of the Zodiac because these are cartoons that I actually was uh, uh, watching back in the early 90s. Um, so of course there is some newer ones and whatnot that are that came out not too long ago But essentially it keeps going with the same somewhat story um, So from everything that has been out it leads me to believe that Seiya is going to be the hero that's released and specifically Sagittarius Seiya um, so I want to go ahead and make a video giving you more details and more background about the character and how it all came to be, what it's all about, because it seems like a lot of people don't really know, don't, don't know much about it. So I want to cover that. Uh, I do also want to cover the Colosseum, which the uh, constellation just recently changed. This one isn't as impactful as last week's, I want to say, but there are a couple of heroes that are going to be very, very nice, especially Black Crow for free-to-play players or Grove Guardians for pay-to-play players. So those are going to be the ones that are highlighted the most, but as you can see, Chaos Dragon also get this buff, so hopefully I can go ahead and feature him as well. Um, and then, of course, I do want to boost some of my troops. Um, because I, I've been wanting to get my T2 to 10 million each 
And then I did want it to boost my tier 5 to about 700 to 750,000 each or so. And then once I do that, then just boost my T4 back up to 3 million. So there's a couple of things that I definitely want to get done. Um, I When I left, I popped, I think it was like a 7 day shield or something. I got 11 hours back or left. So um, that's throughout all my accounts. So I guess... Uh, uh it's time it's time to get back into the flow of things i'll tell you what though i'll tell you what taking a break here and there is always good it's always good this is this is one of the reasons i feel a lot of people when you play games for years and years and years a lot of people's answer is to like quit uh and then they're they, they're back in a month but honestly i feel like i keep a healthy amount of playing the game Taking a little bit of a break, whether it's a couple of days, a couple, a week, hell, even a month. It's it's very healthy because it keeps the game fresh. You don't burn out, you know, etc. Not to say that I was burning out or anything like that, because I definitely wasn't. But you definitely feel it when you step, when you take a little bit of a step back. You kind of relax and stuff like that. You come back and the game just feels fresh uh, all over again. So I would definitely suggest. For all of you that might be thinking about either quitting or getting tired of the game, etc, etc. I would suggest just take a step back, take a couple of days, throw a 3-day shield, throw a 7-day shield. You know, just uh, spend some time with family, friends, away from the game and come back. And I, I bet you, I bet you, you'll feel refreshed. And this is also one of the reasons why so many people quit and they're back in no time. Because honestly, they didn't want to quit, they just wanted a little bit of a break. So... If you're feeling it, definitely I would suggest it. Um, but yeah, my spring break was great. Hopefully yours was uh, great as well. But we're going to get back into the swing of things. Uh, but yeah, appreciate you guys for watching. Look out for all of those videos coming out. And make sure that you take advantage of that Huawei uh, offer. Because it is uh, until the 1st that you have a chance to get those coupons. But yeah, like I said, appreciate you guys for coming through. And until later, bye.